Hi everyone, I'm Elijah D. Welcome to Music Greatness. This is your band, and for today we have It Runs Through Me by Tom Mesh. And it sounds just like this. Right. What I just played was the intro, the verse, and also the pre-chorus in the song. Here we're playing in the key of B minor. And for the intro, verse, and pre-chorus, we have pretty much the same chord progression. We start on B minor 9, B and F sharp for the left, A, C sharp, D and F sharp for the right. going to D9, D and A, C, E and A, then G major 7, G and F sharp, B, D and F sharp, and now we have two chords after that. First we have F sharp 7 at 13, that's F sharp and E for the left. A sharp, D sharp, and F sharp again for the right. And then we're going to switch this note right here by a half step and play D instead. So now we're playing F sharp 7 with a flat 13. And then later in the verse, we're going to play E minor 9. Octave E, G, B, D, and F sharp. And finally, we have C sharp minor 11. That's C sharp for the left, B, D sharp, and F sharp for the right. So that's all the chords we're going to see for the intro, verse, and pre chorus. Once again, we have B minor 9. D9, G major 7, then F sharp 7 at 13, going to F sharp 7, flat 13, and we have also E minor 9, and finally C sharp minor 11. And for the playing pattern, regarding the intro, we have this. So rhythmically, we're pretty much doing the same thing for every chord. Let's start with B minor 9. We have this. One E and two. So first, play your bottom note on your left, then play the rest of the notes, so F sharp, A, C sharp, D, and F sharp. Play that once. Okay, and then repeat. Bottom note on your left, the rest of the notes, and then we're going to play the whole chord twice, like so. And then we have again the bottom note on your left. Then the rest of the notes played twice. 
Exo. So I'm still holding this B down, and then I play twice the rest of the notes. Sounds like this. One E and the two E and the three E and the four E and. One more time. One E and the two E and the three E and the four E and. Let's replay that several times. Three, four. Keep that rhythmic pattern in mind. Next up, we have D9. Just like B minor 9, we're going to play the bottom note on the left. That's D. Then play the rest of the notes. A, C, E, and A. Then repeat, bottom note on your left. Rest of the notes. Then we're going to play the entire chord twice. And we're going to switch the top A here and play B instead. So we have D9 at 13 right now, like so. Then play the bottom note on the left, D. Play the rest of the notes, A, C, E, and B once, and then we play a, C, E, and A this time. Like so. One E and two E and the three E and the four E and. One more time. One E and two E and the three E and the four E and. We're on to G major 7 now, and for the rhythm, we're going to use the same pattern as the B minor 9 chord. Just like so. 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and. So that's the bottom note on your left, G, the rest of the notes, F sharp, B, D, and F sharp. Then again, bottom note rest of the notes, then play twice the whole chord, then bottom note, G, and play twice the rest of the notes. One E and the two E and the three E and the four E and. And finally, for the intro, we have F sharp seven at 13 going to F sharp 7, flat 13. One E and two E and the three E and the four E and. So just like B minor 9 and G major 7, we have the bottom note on the left, this low F sharp here, then the rest of the notes, E, A sharp, D sharp and F sharp. Again, bottom note. That's F sharp, E, A sharp, D sharp, and F sharp. And then we're going to play the entire chord twice. And we're going to switch to D sharp and play D instead. Then bottom note on the left, and play twice the rest of the notes. And now we have E, A sharp, D, and F sharp again. So, one E and the two E and the three E and the four E and. One E and the two E and the three E and the four E and.
Here's the whole intro, slow tempo. We're on the verse, that sounds like this. Just like the intro, we start on B minor 9. On E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and. And then we have this on D9. 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and. So first, play twice. D9 at 13. And for the first time, we have a grace note from A to B using my fourth finger and my pinky, like so. So play the whole chord. Then the bottom note on your left, that's D. Play the rest of the notes. So A, C, E, and B. Then play the whole chord again, twice, and this time playing with A on top. Then the bottom note on your left, once, and playing twice the rest of the notes, A, C, E, and A again. Let's count. 2 E and the 3 E and the 4 E and. Following that, we have G major 7, just like the intro. 1 E and 2 E and the 3 E and the 4 E and. And now we have C sharp minor 11, going to F sharp 7, flat 13. Let's count. 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and. One more time. 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and. So I'm going to play three times my C sharp minor 11. 1 E and 2 E and. The, and then I'm going to play F sharp 7 flat 13 twice, play the whole chord. Play my bottom note on my left, F sharp. Play the rest of the notes once, E, A sharp, D, and F sharp. And then we play those notes. And this time we're going to play G instead of F sharp on top. So like so. So from the top. 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and. 
a little bit faster. And now we're back on B minor 9. Playing the same pattern, same for D9. And here, instead of playing G major 7, we have E minor 9. Same pattern, 1 E and 2. So you have octave E on the left. Play the bottom note, the bottom E, and play the rest of the notes. E, G, B, D, and F sharp. And then again, bottom note, rest of the notes. Play the entire chord twice. Then play quickly the bottom E, and then the rest of the notes twice. Again, we have C sharp minor 11 going to F sharp 7 flat 13. 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and using the same rhythmic pattern. From the top, here's the verse 3, 4. Now we have the pre chorus. For the pre-chorus, we're going to use pretty much the same rhythmic pattern as the verse. So B, mana 9, 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and, then D9, 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and, G major 7, 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and 4 E and then C sharp minor 11 going to F sharp 7 flat 13 and for the pre-chorus we're going to keep the top note here on F sharp okay just like so 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and so don't raise the F sharp to G like we did for the verse. And then we're going to repeat the same progression. B minor 9. D9. G major 7. C sharp 11 going to F sharp 7. One more time, slow, the entire pre-chorus, three, four,
Great, that's all you need for the intro, verse and pre-chorus. Now let's recap from the top and play the entire thing from the intro at full speed. And that's it for this first part. For the rest of the song, you can head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, guys, thank you for watching. If you love the content, leave a like, leave a comment, and also don't forget to subscribe. Until then, see you next week for another Urban.